It's Monday. It's time to talk technology, and that means our tech expert, Luis Alvarez, joins us right now on Power Talk. Hey, Luis, how's it going? Pretty good, Mark. How are you? Very well. So let's talk about what's in the news tech-wise today, and it's Apple's 2024 iPads, and this has got uh, some real benefits for working professionals. What's going on? Yeah, this is the first time Apple has released an iPad in quite a while. It's been a few years. You know, normally we're used to every year they come out with something new, but for the last few years, Apple has been, you know, just kind of keeping the same uh, iPads uh, that have been out there. And now they've introduced a couple of new ones, an 11 inch model that's uh, very similar to the smaller ones that everybody's used to. And then a 13 inch model that uh, is the same screen size as the MacBook Air and then the MacBook Pro, their laptop. So it's, it's a larger screen. And- and it's uh, something that professionals who use tablets might be interested in looking at because mm-hmm. one of the other things that they've introduced is a new pen. That's right. Like a, their Pencil Pro, they call it. It's a stylus that it works with both the smaller iPad Air and then the larger iPad Pro. So you can basically use it to write on your screen, which is something that uh, until recently Apple has not offered. Oh, neat. Now, on the CPU side, this 2024 Air is powered by Apple's new M2 chip, which is an upgrade from the previous model's M1 chip. What do you know about that? Yeah, so this is Apple started building their own chips a few years ago. They had relied on Intel and AMD and others to produce their chips, and they decided, hey, we're going to get into the semiconductor business ourselves. So they came up with their M1 chip, which was a uh, pretty powerful CPU, and, and this one is th- three times faster than the uh, M1, so it's a significant upgrade for mm-hmm. folks that like want to use their iPad for things like illustrations or artificial intelligence and machine learning. It's just going to be able to provide a lot more horsepower for those kind of functions. And it comes with a brand new ultra wide 12 megapixel camera. And as far as um, storage options, base capacity is 128 gigabits, but it can go all the way up to 512 or one terabyte. Always buy the biggest amount that you can afford because it just means a better running machine and you'll always want more down the line. Absolutely. We tend to be pack rats. So that's yes. a good piece of advice. All right. That's Luis Alvarez, CEO of the Alvarez Technology Group joining us today. Online, AlvarezTG.com, at AlvarezTG is the X handle. Lewis, the toll-free number for the I-Team. Give us a call at 866-78-I-Team. That's 866-784-8326.